call him the Jesus of golf because, of course, his appearance. And it might stick for another reason if North Carolina native Jacob Galladay could pull off one last miracle this week. Chris Lee has the story. We're down in Mexico. Everyone is calling me Jesus. For God so loved the world that he gave us, Jacob Galladay. After college baseball, I spent a little, spent a little time up in uh, Northern California and Lake Tahoe and became kind of the true hippie, I would say, and uh, came back to the Carolinas with this. He's electrified fans on the World Long Drive Tour, where he's notched a career-long 456 yards on a drive. His legend has him at over 26,000 disciples on Instagram. And now he's going for another goal. You know, long drivers aren't supposed to be doing this first off, as my buddy Willie Wilcox always tells me. Galladay has a chance to qualify for the U.S. Open Monday at Canoebrook Country Club in Summit, New Jersey. It may be divine intervention that this year's U.S. Open is in Pinehurst, the place that Galladay learned the game from his mother, Nancy Melsness, who was a former tournament director there in the 80s. There would probably be endless tears from her for about two weeks, and then uh, we'd be ready to rock and roll. So this weekend... Say a prayer for Jacob Galladay as he's in pursuit of the kingdom of golf heaven. It's always a dream to make the U.S. Open, but to be able to make the U.S. Open in a town that taught you the game, you know, it doesn't, it's just like, there's no way, right? Amen. Chris Lee, WREL Sports, Raleigh.